New responses from Congress over the Mueller report. Democrats and Republicans overwhelmingly demanding the full release of the report. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi insisting any congressional briefings be unclassified. Democrats vowing action if anything is held back. ABC's Mary Bruce is on the Hill. Tonight, Robert Mueller's work may be over, but the fight on Capitol Hill is just getting started. The American people have a right to the truth. The watchword is transparency. Democrats are demanding the special counsel's full report, and they're prepared to use their subpoena power to get it. We will certainly subpoena uh, the parts of the report, and we will reserve the right to call uh, Mueller or, or uh, to testify before the committee or to subpoena him. With all options on the table, Robert Mueller and the attorney general could be made to testify. The attorney general committed to making as much of it uh, public as was consistent with law or policy. If he's true to that, it means the entire thing, and we're going to insist upon it. After nearly two years and 25 million taxpayer dollars, members on both sides of the aisle say the public deserves to see the results. The top Republican on the House Judiciary Committee, Doug Collins, tweeting that the report should be released without delay and to the maximum extent permitted by law. What comes next? Now an issue on the campaign trail, too. That report needs to be made public. Yeah. Uh, yes. The American people have a right and a need to know. But what really matters to our democracy as we approach 2020, does he follow the rules from the special counsel that say that it is in the public interest? And Democrats don't just want the full report, they want the underlying evidence too. We need to see the Mueller report, not the Barr report. The American people paid for the Mueller report and they deserve to know all of the findings and evidence. And Mary joins us now from Capitol Hill. Mary, the Democrats have already made their first move, sending notice to the Trump administration about the records on the Mueller probe. Yeah, Tom, House Democrats here are wasting no time requesting that the White House counsel, the FBI, and the Justice Department preserve all documents and records related to the Mueller report, information the Democrats are hoping to get their hands on soon. Tom. Mary Bruce for us tonight. Mary, thank you. And a very busy weekend in Washington. Stay with ABC News for continuing coverage of the Mueller report. House Intelligence Committee Chairman Adam Schiff and ranking member of the House Oversight Committee Jim Jordan will be tomorrow's guest on This Week with George Stephanopoulos. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.